Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Undertale in the last episode. We made it out of our fight with Undyne. It was really stinking difficult, but we somehow did it. And of course, being the pacifist that we are, we brought her back to life when she entered the Hotlands because she was a stinking fish and she was boiling up and getting fried. So hopefully we won't grow to regret that later. So Papyrus said that he wanted us to go back to her house. We know where her house is. Should I go all the way back there? What the fruit? Oh, I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. That makes zero sense. Huh. Well, also, what the fruit is Sans? Sans is gone. Of course he is. Um. So I'm wondering, though. Of course, I'm just gonna go all the way back to uh, Undyne's house and see if anything changes there. So, let's see if me giving her water was worth it. Be our bizzle. What the fruit? This thing's here. But today's monsters don't appreciate what makes puzzles great. Nowadays, puzzles are nothing but lasers and moving rocks. Bah! There's no art in that ancient, a action-y, mindless schlock. It's just tim timing-based drivel. Give me something that challenges the deepest reaches of my mind. You! You're young! you still got hope! Gehehe! <laughs> Here, try solving this block-pushing puzzle. What? What are you doing? You're pushing it all wrong! Bah! Forget it! This generation is really hopeless. Bah. 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 What the fruit? I don't understand. Mind. Uh, okay, then. I'm sure I could have done that correctly somehow, some way, but I'm just too millennially to get it done. But yeah, if anything else changes along the way, I'll show you, but otherwise, I'm going back to Undyne's house. What the fruit? Um, I think I found Temi Village by accident. Hi, welcome to Temi Village! That's not the voice I'm giving her. Hi, I'm Temi! And this is my friend Temi! Hi, I'm Temi! And this is my friend Temi! Hi, I'm Temi! Don't forget my friend! Hi, I'm Bob. <laughs> okay, you feel something. You're filled with determination. I'm very glad I went back then. What the fruit is this place? It's so adorable and creepy. Wow, 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 human, such a cute. Tom Watts Ugg, Ugg will hatch. Tom Hard Parent. Tim, her human allergies to Tim. That okay, Tim understand. Tim, also allergic to Tim. Oh god. Oh no. No! I'll get away, I promise. Oh jeez, I feel horrible. Hoives! Hoives! Mushroom dance, mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean? I assume you're the Mr. Saturns of this universe. It means you've lived a life of sin. What the fruit? Uh, you're in the wall, feeling of being watched. Statue of Tem. Very famous. Very! What the fruit even is this? It's hard-boiled. Oh, it's not gonna hatch. Ahoy, you should check out Tem Shop. Yeah, I agree, should check Tem Shop. Use the box, yes. We're gonna take out some stuff and sell it. Hey, welcome to the thumb shop! You terrify me. Uh, we're gonna sell the stick. Whoa! You got a sticks! Mm! I got a hand yet sticks, but I got to pay for calling! Mm! Tim always want a sticks! Ten by stick for one five one cheer! No! Okay then, this thing is singing terrifying. Toy knife? A uh, 10 by toy knife for 100G? Yeah, yeah, or no! Uh, I'm gonna sell the ribbon. I'm sure that there's something that these items can be used for in the future, but I doubt they're gonna tell me it's gonna just be a random chance, so I'm just gonna keep on selling it. 
And the mandana. Thanks, purchase. Uh, mandana. So, do you have anything we could buy? We got Tem Flakes. Heals 2 HP of food of Tem. Uh, we got heals 2 HP. Discount of food of Tem. Tem Flake on sale. What the fruit? This is stupid. Heals 2 HP food of Tem. Expensive. What? Hi, welcome to some. And then 1000 G Tem pay for college. College Tem pursue higher education. I really want to pay for her college. I'm gonna have to go do some off-screen training because I just really wanted to experience this. So I'll come back with a thousand G. I'm gonna lose all, my, all I stink and have. Uh, let me see. Can I sell some things that could help in that? I want to sell the butts pie. Snow piece. No, I don't want to sell that either. Dog rose and do cinnamon. Those are cheap. No, not worth it. Uh, talk, I guess. Say hello. Hold oh, on, Tommy. Hi! I'm Timmy! That's it? Okay. About yourself. Hi! I'm Timmy! Timmy history! Us Tims have a deep history! Uh, you're not gonna tell us? About shop. Yeah, yeah! Go to Tim shop! That's it. Cool. Boy! Boy is like buy, but like, you're just like, boy! Use the box, sure. Nice cream, nice cream, nice cream, tough glove. Ooh, I can sell the tough glove. Uh, let's go sell the tough glove for 50 G. Uh, it's not very smart that she's buying things from us because she's trying to pay for Kaleg. Uh, I was wondering if like the price went up the more she uh, bought stuff from me, but no, it doesn't. So I need to get a thousand stinking G. The question is though, do I grind right now or do I just go on with my adventure and I'll come back later if I can remember? And find my way. This was sort of an accident. Rich history of Tim. Huh. Okay. I don't know who I like more. The Thames or the Mr. Saturns. I'm, it's, I'm sure it's like sacrilegious to even say that, but they're pretty stinking incredible. I'll say that. Um, the Tem plush is actually the only one I don't have. I have Toriel, Papyrus, and Sans, but I have yet to get the Tem plush. It actually comes with a cardboard box, which is very stinking funny. <laughs> Uh, and, uh, it's a keychain of s some kind as well. Very interesting. I was originally not interested in the keychain, but now that I know the lore behind it, I think I will purchase the keychain along with the plushie. So, Tem, vi Tem Villages South, duly noted. So, I was definitely wondering that if, uh... Because it was all in the dark and something. I knew there were going to be branching paths or stuff during the segment that I would miss. And of course, the one thing that I missed was Tem Village. So, I'm very, very glad I went back. Now we get to go to see Undyne's house. And see how wonderful, wonderful that's going to be for us. Oh boy. Back over here. Papyrus said to go to Undyne's house. And I believe that is right over here. Here he is. I asked Undyne if we could all hang. But she said something weird. She said she won't hang out with a murderer. I didn't murder anyone. Well, Toriel. But hmm, I don't remember murdering anyone. Though I am a pretty brutal kind of guy. Then she said something about wanting to fight some kind of bad guy. But she seems very weak from something. She stepped out and collapsed in the doorway. So I'm just waiting here in case she needs me. Since she hates being waited on hand and foot, I think we'll have to hang out later. Hey, I really doubt we're going to be able to hang. It's hard to imagine, but you'll have to spend time with not me. Is this because I accidentally killed one enemy and also Toria? Like, if I had a perfect pacifist run up to this point, would I be able to hang out with Undyne right now? I feel like that's the case. Uh, what, what, what? It's a living. It's a living. <laughs> That's all there is, unfortunately. Huh. We never saw the other ghost house either. It's still locked. You think it's snail races? Oh, hi, ghosty. I missed you. But, yeah, I guess we can't hang out with Undone. We got the extra dialogue with Papyrus. It was worth it just for the sake of finding Tem Village, so that's nice, but... 
We still do not have enough to pay for Tem's colleague. So, unfortunately, we're just going to have to go on forward. I might, if I can find a enemy along the way and see how much money it gives me, then I'll debate whether or not I want to just off-screen train, I guess, just so I could get the money for it. Uh, as soon as I find an enemy, I'll let you know, and then I'll uh, cut away and show you my decision, I guess. So, see you guys in just a moment. Are you just carrying that around to look sophisticated? Because it's not working. Uh, could I give it to someone then? Because I don't want it. Can I put it back? Get rid of the water? Yes. You pour water on the ground next to the water cooler. It's not what I want it to do. Now I just have a puddle. Small puddle, full weight. Uh, okay. It was thirsty, so I came over here. Okay, whatever. I did not find a single stinking enemy on my way back, so I'm just gonna go on forward and I'll pay for Tem's colleague later. If I remember. A lab. Uh, that looks like progress. Let's go downstairs. What the fruit? Here's Satan on his magical boat of happiness. Tra la la! I'm the river man! Or am I the river woman? It doesn't really matter. I'd love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Ride in the boat? Not this second. Then perhaps another time. Or perhaps not. It doesn't really matter. I assume you're a fast travel system. Sorry, Undyne, like, told me, told us there was a totally a human in this Wow, I cannot read. So, like, us royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Yeah, even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. Interesting. Save the game, and now I'll go ahead and see what this dude's all about. Let's ride in the boat. Where will we go today? Snowden Waterfall. Oh, it is a really good fast travel system. Okay. Huh. Where do I want to go? So tell me, do you want to go? Um, a place with enemies? I don't know. Let's go to Snowden, I guess. And we're off. Tra la la, what's inside an acorn? It's really just a mystery. Not really. Or is it? And we're back here. Oh, that's where that dead end was for. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's continue to play monsters and humans. Okay, I remember. So, all those dead end areas, that's probably where that leads to. And I noticed that you just keep on throwing these in, like we saw another area where the ice blocks were still rolling along. Okay, I'm understanding how the world works a bit better now. Uh, we got grill bees. Uh, nothing we could really do here. I just wanted to find enemies that I could fight and get money from. Like, it's so stinging hard to find anything. Like, when I actually want to run into an enemy, they're just never around. Oh god, I don't even want to attempt, like, looking around, trying to do everything, so we're just gonna do today. Waterfall, Hotland, we're gonna go back to Hotland, and we're off. What the fruit? That was creepy. It's Jesus! Tra-la-la, Temi Village! Wait, what? The room before the darkening lantern room. Okay, you just tell us where Temi, Temi Village is. And we're good. Thank you, Satan. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Well, joke's on you. I found Temmie Village all on my own. Let's go in here, and I believe I know who's about to show up. I was not expecting that, but okay. Huh. Let's see. It's you! Uh, it's too dark to see near walls. What? That's awkward. What do you mean it's too dark? I could see everything just fine. Yep, I had a feeling it was you. You're also a figurine. <laughs> and you look very similar to that other annoying guy, so I don't really like you right off the bat. Oh my god! I didn't expect you to show up so soon! I haven't showered, I'm barely dressed, it's all messy and... Um, hiya! 
I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, 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 ah, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Oh, I know who that is. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Actually, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small snail, small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti-human anti combat features? Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so. And, um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. Crashes through the wall. Did you hear something? Oh no. Oh yes! Welcome, beauties! He actually did crash through the wall. To today's quiz show! Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show! Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant! Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly! Or you die! Okay, Metaton attacks. What do? Metaton check cry. Metaton attack 30, defense 255. His middle body renders him invulnerable to attack. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Uh, money, mercy, more questions, new car! Mercy? Oh, you wish wrong! Jesus Christ! The quiz show continues! Uh... Um... <laughs> attack... Miss... God darn it. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Oh, I know that. Lord Fluffy Buns, Fluffy Pushover, Dr. Friendship, Asgore Dreamer. Correct, what a terrific answer. Quiz show continues. Uh, let's see. I guess we just cry. Screaming is against the rules. Okay, enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Hopes and dreams, metal and magic, sugar and spice, snipes and ships and snails. Hopes and dreams, what? All of them were right except for the one that I chose. The quiz show continues. Uh, cry, scream is against the rules. There's another easy one for you. What the fruit? Two trains, another train, A and B, simulation, Oh my Christ. Uh. Oh, dip. I always go with the one that just looks different from all the rest. God darn it. Oh. Quiz show continues. Oh my God. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? Oh my Christ. I feel like I have to lose this. There's no way it's gonna actually work. 52? Completely, utterly wrong. The quiz show continues. Mercy spare. Let's play memory game. Oh god, the monster's this. A frog. -it. it is a frog. -it. What? Boy, that's embarrassing, huh? Wow. The quiz show continues. <laughs> Trying to break out the big guns. In the dating simulation video game, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Oh, I know this one! It's snail ice cream! In the fourth chapter, she buys the ice cream for all her friends, and but the snail flavor, she's the only one who wants it. Uh, this is actually a very powerful message about friendship and... Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? 
Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphys have a crush on? Uh-oh. Asgore Undyne, the human don't know. Undyne? See, Alphys, I told you it was obvious. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she screams her name in the margins of her notes. She names programming variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. Sharing a domestic life. Probability of crush, 101%. Margin of error, 1%. Well, 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 with Dr. Alphys helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can go on like this, but, but, this was just a pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings! Well, that was certainly something. Oh boy! That last question, he wasn't supposed to ask that one. Is Metaton just taking- no, I can't even go in there. I was wondering if I could just go talk to him. That was something- it's a bathroom sign. And I assume this is a bathroom. Wait, wait! Let me give you my phone number. I don't want your phone number. And maybe if you need help, I could- Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second, please. It doesn't even have texting. Here, I upgraded it for you. It could do texting items. It's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. Hee hee hee. Hee hee. Hey. I'm going to the bathroom. Yellow feet are tapping just behind the door. It's bathroom sign. Okay, uh, what about if I call him in the bathroom or call her in the bathroom? Dimensional box A, dimensional box B, what? Okay, well, oh, 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 oh. Huh. More storage. Very, very nice. Okay, right when I get the ability to get rid of storage, I have more storage. Uh, what if I go up here? Got books. Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. <laughs> VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They are all labeled human history. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Somehow that's a JoJo reference. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside the book. In this comic book, a hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. No, it strikes me as very accurate. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. Is it tubby custard? Pink goop drips. Okay. Uh, looks like Alpha's work table seems dusty. Huh. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. I should probably go heal, I just realized. It's a lamp with a pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's very funny. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. I think that's actually a poster you could get at FANGAMER! Shameless plug. Okay, examine all these things now. A garbage can, but it's pretty cute. <laughs> uh, seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to, to a game, or... It's a computer. It's, ac it's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. It's a beat-up figurine of a female human with cat ears. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Sure. You got the instant noodles. It's a half-empty bag of dog food. And Alphys is just gone? Interesting. Uh, what does this do? Nothing. Uh, let me head back out. I have- yeah, I have one HP, so we should definitely go back and heal. 
Something I still wish- oh hello. Alvis updated stats. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Sad face. Uh, but yeah, it was- oh my Christ. Alvis updates that as well. Oh my God, that's it. We got a new phone, so we get notified every time she update her st updates her status on like Facebook or something. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. Let's see how quickly I could disassemble this. Uh, for now, I gotta call the human and guide them. Okay. As I was trying to say, this looks cool. As I was trying to say, Vulcan scroll strolls in. That looks very cute. Uh, criticize well, for what? Encourage a hug. I want a hug. You give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart and your whole body. Ouch! Your defense dropped. Ah, so lovely. What was I even trying to say? Oh yeah, something that I really missed. Jesus Christ! Spare. You want earn zero experience of forty gold. And this actually would be a good place for grinding because I don't need to walk. I don't even need to walk. I just stand on this. Uh, but yes, yeah, as, as I was trying to say, I'll just walk around here while I'm trying to get money because I don't want to forget about Temp's colleague. Um, something that I miss from Earthbound and uh, Mother Three is just a traveling party. I would really like it. I don't know what they're. Even if they didn't do anything for me in battle, if, I would just prefer if these characters that I've met so far would just travel with me for a while. Granted, some of them are kind of annoying, so I wouldn't want all of them traveling with me, but like certain ones like Sans or Papyrus or Toriel, uh, I would definitely like it. And of course, as soon as I try doing this, it's like, okay, as soon as I mention it, hello, a Rhinoceros rocket, a Sunder plane gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. <laughs> um, uh, you can flirt with it. You tell Sunder plane that you like its taste in movies and books. Oh, you sicko. And planes fly by. Cool. This is the weirdest stinking game in the universe. Uh, approach. You get close to Sunder Plane, but not too close. Ye human? It's a green plane. What does green mean? Oh god. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Wait. Oh wait, no. Green heals me. I forgot about that. Uh, shakes its nose dismissively at you. Uh, let's approach it again. Get close. Ye human. Let's go. Oh no, I have to. That's awkward. I have to go into the green and then get out of that green. Then spare. One earns zero experience and 60 gold. Which gold do I have? Uh, 894. Okay, so we're getting there. Uh, I'll just cut away till I get the money for Kaleg. Because I really want to do that. Pot pie rope bounds towards you. Uh, cool down. You blow on Pyro, but its flames die down. Pyro's attack dropped. Oh, uh, what's the deal? What's the deal with Undertale? Ouchies. Ouchies. That's a very scary attack. Uh, let's see. Heat up invite. You invite Pyro to hang out. Sorry, I'm all tied up. Her, her, her. Uh, I really hate this attack. Oh, God. This is horrible. It's pretending to be a candle. Uh, heat up. You crank up the thermostat, Pyro begins to get excited. Hot, hot, hot! Uh, I assume the attack's just the same. Okay, oh god. I have to actually attack it. Okay, there it goes. I feel the heat. Uh, I'm regretting all my life choices. I hate this attack and this enemy. I really don't like it at all. Uh, let's see. That and okay, burn, baby, burn. Oh, what the fruit? What the fruit? What the fruit? What the fruit? I have to go through the flames. Okay, through the fire and the flames we go. That's still not enough. Cool down. You blow on pyro, but flames die down. Pyro's attack drop. Good. Uh, okay. Boom shakalaka. Boom shakalaka. Boom a boom. Oh god. Can we get even hotter? Oh jeez. Oh jeez. And spare. I just have to heat it up twice and then I win. God stinking darn it. Almost had enough money for Kaleg. This better be stinking worth it, Temmie. You're just great. Thank you, Nice Cream. I've got enough money. 
for Kaleg. This better be magical. Well, welcome to the Tim Shop! Tim paid for college for 1,000 G! Kaleg, Tim pursue higher education! Buy for 1,000 G! Whoa! That's a lot of moons! Can they really exist? Ox! Tim, go to Kaleg and make you proud! What the fruit? Oh god. But <laughs> she's back. Tim back from cooling! Tim learned many things! Learn to sell new item, ya yeah, ya! Yeah. Uh, 9,000 Temi armor. 20 defense makes battles too easy. Huh. So, for having her go to Kaleg, she gets a hat and now could sell you the ultimate armor, supposedly. But it costs 9,000 G! You don't have the months. But I want it. I paid for your Kaleg education! That's not good enough, Tim. Well, that was about Temmy armor. Tim armor so good! And he better become an easy victorious! But um, Tim think if you use armor's better world to be challenged anymore. But Tim has a solution! Tim will love for scholarships! If you lose a lot of battles, Tim will lower the prize! So if you go to get to tough battle and feel frustrated, you can put Tim out in the last resort! But Tim is so good, promise only, baby, he really needs it! So that's how we can make it a bit cheaper, it's like an easy mode thing. Okay. Uh, Timmy history about shop, say hello. <laughs> I'm just gonna go. Boy! Well, if I find my new favorite character in the game, I think that's a pretty satisfying note to end on. So, we met Alphys, we fought Metatum, we found the legendary Tem Shop. I think that's a lot of cool stuff for this episode. Next time on Undertale, we are going to explore Hotland in actual exploration instead of just showing up at the front door and then going backwards and forward and backward and forward and backward and forward over and over and over again. How the fruit do I get back? This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.